Hi everybody, this is Shane Armand Rowe, and today we are going to take a look, a new look at the forest on the Steam Deck. Reason I decided to make this one, you probably already saw my forest video that I did previously, but, but that was an older version of the Steam OS. Now we're on Steam OS 3.5. The forest is on sale again. It's a great time to revisit this title and see if 3.5 has a miraculous effect on the performance of the forest. Now I've already got a game in progress. And it's just at the very, very beginning of day zero. I've, uh, I built a basic uh, temporary shelter so that I could save, but otherwise I haven't done a lot of running around. Uh, I did a fresh install, so if you're worried about shaders or anything like that, this is literally a fresh install without having run around and done much. So hopefully this is as clean as humanly possible. I am on the latest beta of OS 3.5, not 3.6, 3.5, and uh, I've got the overlay going so that you can see what we're looking at. Now, um, playing the game on the, uh, on the deck right now, but I'm capturing on the Elgato so I'm limited to 720p, but I can tell you it performs uh, about the same on 800p. You're not going to see a whole lot of difference. Now, if you remember the last time uh, I played this game and I showed you running around the forest, we were seeing things like 35 FPS, 43 FPS. Even when doing high deltas and running around at the same time, you can see that we're maintaining a very nice tight 50, 55 uh, even doing a lot of delta looking around, running, all that stuff. We'll swing the axe a little bit while we're doing everything. You can see that we're maintaining in the 50s. This is a huge boost. Now, there were times when I was playing uh, on the deck before, and I honestly, you know, games that require swift combat and things like that, you may be uh, a little hesitant to play at 35 FPS or with FPS jumping all over the place. Now, I can't change to 4040 here because of the Elgato capture card, but I can assure you that there should be no problems whatsoever in this game obtaining 4040 and staying there. I even chopped down a tree. Oops, sorry. I'm kind of uh, extending, my, uh, extending my reach here to get the deck, so... It looks a little dark, too. I don't know why. Probably just my settings and going through the Elgato. Hang on. Let's chop down a tree and get some physics going here. Make sure that FPS stays up. Ah, my stamina keeps running out. I'm not in the great position. I just got off a crashed plane for crying out loud. Yeah, great. Stayed in the 50s the whole time. That's fantastic. Let's get a little draw distance. Now, this is on high settings. Let's go ahead and review the settings real quick. So if we look at our graphics, uh, there are some things. That's weird. I thought I said high in the, uh, let's see here. Let's go ahead and change it to the high preset. We are in DX11. Uh, during the uh, startup, you actually set your... Um, you set your quality, and I set it originally. Let's see what we got now. Okay, so on high, we're now seeing still pretty close to 50. I know my stamina keeps running out, so I can't keep charging all over the place. But even a nice 50, I mean, we were not getting anywhere near this. I mean, this was a very nice, this is probably 15 to 20% improvement. I don't want to give. I don't want to do too much here because I don't want to give anything away. But even now, with far draw, the uh, the haze, the fog, right? Everything is still running really fast. I'm very pleased. Deer. Yeah, the game definitely gets a huge boost. Huge boost. Honestly, I'm gonna I'm gonna say it. I think this game has got the biggest boost from 3.5 that I've seen yet. That's that's saying a lot. Obviously, if you're willing to play in medium or even low or dink with the um, options a little bit more, you could probably get 60 at this on this thing at this point. Uh, let's see. I don't want to do a ton of screwing around with this thing, but probably want to turn up that cave brightness at some point. 
But yeah, so here's all the different settings you can monkey with, and there's a lot, right? Draw distance we could probably turn down a little bit, light scatter. There's a whole bunch of things in here that I'm betting that we could probably bring this, get this up to 60. Maybe not. Sometimes you can turn them all off and you still won't get 60. But listen, at 50, anything above 40, you know, we could lock it at 40. 40 would make this game totally playable. I'm sorry, I have no stamina. I'm thirsty. Hard to run around when you have no stamina. But look at this. This is fantastic. Now, I'd probably have to go crawling around in a cave to make absolutely sure. But, you know, the cave is close draw. You know, it doesn't have a lot of distance in it. Not a lot of, um, I mean, I can't imagine the caves being worse than this, but who knows. So anyway, yeah, this is fantastic. Uh, this is a huge improvement. The forest is on sale again. It's almost always on sale. And uh, if you're looking for a game for the deck, this is, uh, uh, listen, I've played almost uh, like 250 hours, 300 hours in this game. I don't get tired of it. Every, every few months, I boot it back up. I run around. I build stuff. Uh, there is a full-blown story in this game. So there is something to do front to back. So this is a game you could finish playing by yourself or with your friends. At the same time, if you bring your friends in, you can... Ah, uh, here we go. Here's a little bit more dense foliage. We're starting to get a little bit... Okay, we did pop into the 30s here. Just have to get the right scenario. Still, it's a lot better than it was. Considerably better. And that's when we're on high. I bet if we, um, just for just for giggles here, let's go ahead and set this to medium. Run through that same area again. The dense stuff. Yeah, it's much better. Yeah, I think, it, it, now this is it, you know, you're watching this probably on a big monitor uh, on YouTube, but uh, honestly, on a 7-inch screen, medium's going to look great. Yeah, such a great game. I think the last time I saw it on sale was five bucks. I mean, got 300 hours for five bucks. Let's, where's your ROI? That's it. That's it right there. All right. Well, listen, I wanted to make this short and sweet. I just wanted to show you guys around a little bit, let you guys see what the force looks like now on OS 3.5. If uh, you're not on 3.5 yet, uh, look in the upper uh, right hand corner there. I'll have a link to my original forest that was running uh, on an earlier version of the OS, and you can see if that's suitable for you. I also go into controller configuration and some other stuff, which is still germane to the game even today. All right, everybody, this is Shane Armandro. Thanks so much for watching. If you like what you saw, hit the thumbs up, subscribe, and of course, hit that bell. It uh, helps us out. We appreciate it. Thanks so much for watching. Take care.